Let's have a closer look to common pool resources, especially to the tragedy of the commons. So let's approach that issue with game theory. Typically game theory, you have three elements. First, you have to specify the players. Here in this case, it's firm one and firm two. You have to specify the strategies. Here it is pollute and don't pollute. And thirdly, it's about payoff matrix here it's in dollars and uh, earnings and i refer to an, an example you can find in asimoglu et al 2019. right so how do you read that uh, payoff matrix how do you come to the nash equilibrium to the best response given uh, the strategies of the other player so player one, firm one, player two, firm two. That's the game. These are the strategies. And we want to find the best response of firm one, given the strategies of firm two, and the best response of firm two, given the strategies of firm one. And we end up in a strategic dominant uh, equilibrium. Uh, and uh, a Nash equilibrium. So how do we read the payoff matrix? Um, let's do it like that. Now, think of firm one. What is the best response of firm one given that payoff matrix if firm two pollutes, chooses strategy one pollution? Well, you see here in red, payoff is 5,000 versus 50,000, so firm one chooses to pollute in case firm two pollutes, right? And now assume that firm two chooses the strategy not to pollute. What is the best response of firm one given the payoffs? 70 is less than 90. So 90,000 means is uh, the payoff in case of pollution. So this, the firm one's decision is best response, both strategy is to pollute. Now do the same reasoning for firm number two. The best response of firm number two in case firm number one pollutes is don't pollute 5,000, pollute 50,000. So the outcome is 50,000. Firm one's best response is to pollute. And uh, in case firm one doesn't pollute, firm's two best response is. 90,000 is more than 70,000 is also to pollute. So as you can see, given these uh, payoffs, the strategic uh, dominant equilibrium, uh, the Nash equilibrium here is uh, this one here. So the best response for both. And uh, that's our problem. That's our issue. We end up here pollution, pollution, and we would like to, to go there where the earnings are even higher, right? The earnings are even higher, and uh, uh, in case both do not pollute. But how to come from this Nash equilibrium to such a, an equilibrium where both firms do not pollute? And that's our issue, that's where we have to find ways how we can come from here to here.